Within each of us lies a unique set of strengths and weaknesses, which shape our journey through life. It's these unique aspects that make us who we are. They dictate how we navigate the world, how we interact with others, and how we perceive ourselves. They're our internal compass, guiding us through the complexities of life, helping us make decisions, and steering us towards or away from certain paths. But these strengths and weaknesses are not merely innate characteristics that we're born with. They're shaped and molded by our experiences, our environment, and our choices. They're dynamic, changing and evolving as we grow and learn. They're not set in stone, but rather they're like clay, malleable and adaptable. The key, however, lies in recognizing and understanding these strengths and weaknesses. It's about peeling back the layers and diving deep into the core of our being. It's about self-discovery, reflection, and introspection. And it's about embracing these strengths and weaknesses, not shying away from them, but rather harnessing them to unlock our full potential. Hello, and welcome to this enlightening journey of self-discovery. I'll be your guide as we delve into the fascinating world of strengths and weaknesses. We'll explore what they are, why they matter, and how you can leverage them to lead a more fulfilling and authentic life. We'll learn how to identify your strengths and weaknesses, and how to use this knowledge to your advantage. We'll discuss how you can build on your strengths and turn your weaknesses into opportunities for growth. And we'll explore how understanding your strengths and weaknesses can help you align your life with your true self. This journey is not about changing who you are, but rather, it's about understanding who you are. It's about celebrating your strengths and acknowledging your weaknesses. It's about using this knowledge to create a life that's in harmony with your true self. Understanding our strengths and weaknesses is not just about self-improvement, it's about creating a life that aligns with our true selves. So, let's embark on this journey together and discover the power of embracing our unique strengths and weaknesses. Our strengths are like lighthouses, guiding us toward our best paths. They are the qualities that set us apart make us unique, and help us shine in our own individual ways. They are our natural abilities, the things we do well, often without much effort. They encompass our talents, our skills, and our passions, and they play a crucial role in shaping our lives and our success. Conversely, our weaknesses are those aspects we may struggle with. They're the areas we might need to work on, the things that challenge us. But it's essential to remember that weaknesses are not necessarily negative. Instead, they represent opportunities for growth and development. Understanding our strengths and weaknesses is not just about self-improvement. It's about creating a life that aligns with our true selves. When we harness our strengths, we can reach our full potential. And when we acknowledge our weaknesses, we open doors to growth and transformation. But how do we identify these elements within ourselves? It all starts with self-reflection. Take some time to think about your life experiences. When did you feel most accomplished? What tasks do you enjoy and excel at? These are likely areas of strength. On the other hand, consider the times you've faced challenges or criticism. What areas were highlighted? These could point to potential weaknesses. Honesty is another crucial component. It's easy to gloss over our shortcomings, but true growth comes from facing them head on. Be truthful with yourself about where you excel and where you might need improvement. Sometimes, Feedback from those around us can also be invaluable. People who know us well can often provide insights into our strengths and weaknesses that we might overlook. By understanding our strengths, we can leverage them to create success and fulfillment in our lives. By acknowledging our weaknesses, we can address them, learn from them, and grow. It starts with reflection, honesty, and sometimes feedback from those around us. The journey of self-discovery is a lifelong one. But understanding our strengths and weaknesses is a significant step on the path to personal growth. Self-awareness is the foundation of personal development. These are not just words, but a profound truth that forms the cornerstone of our journey toward self-improvement. And to help us delve deeper into this concept, we revive the literature in the field of personal development. The evidence emphasizes the importance of recognizing our strengths and weaknesses, not as opposing forces, but as two sides of the same coin, both essential to our personal growth. Furthermore, each one of us is a unique blend of talents, skills, and areas of improvement. The first step is acknowledging this blend. The second step is understanding how to work with it. Let's take a moment to reflect on the idea of strengths. Often we associate strengths with skills or talents we excel at, but our expert explains that strengths are more than just what we're good at. 
They are inherent qualities that energize us and allow us to perform at our best. They are the aspects of ourselves that we should lean into and leverage to reach our full potential. On the flip side, we have weaknesses. Often seen as shortcomings or flaws, experts urge us to view weaknesses as opportunities for growth. Weaknesses are not roadblocks but stepping stones. They highlight areas where we can improve, learn, and grow. The key is not to avoid or hide from them, but to face them head on. As we journey towards self-improvement, it's important to remember that it's not about eradicating our weaknesses or inflating our strengths. It's about balance. It's about using our strengths as a foundation to build upon and our weaknesses as areas to cultivate and develop. Our expert leaves us with these final words of wisdom. By understanding our strengths, we can leverage them. By acknowledging our weaknesses, we can address them. The statement is a powerful reminder that the path to personal growth is not about perfection, but about embracing and understanding all aspects of ourselves. With this knowledge, let's explore an exercise designed to help us map our strengths and weaknesses. This self-assessment isn't about judgment, it's about understanding. So, grab a pen and paper or open a digital document and let's delve into the core of our being. First, close your eyes and think about moments when you felt most proud of your achievements. What qualities did you exhibit? Were you persistent, creative, empathetic, or perhaps a great problem solver? Write these down. These are your potential strengths, the qualities that give you the power to shine. They're your superpowers in the journey of life. Next, reflect on times you faced challenges or constructive criticism. What areas were highlighted? Were you impatient, indecisive, or maybe too focused on details? Remember, this isn't about self-criticism. It's about self-awareness. Consider these as your areas for growth your weaknesses. They are not roadblocks, but signposts pointing towards opportunities for growth. Now that you have your list, take a moment to absorb it. You've taken a significant step towards understanding your inner landscape. You've identified your unique set of strengths and weaknesses, and that's no small feat. The next step in this journey of self-discovery is setting personal development goals. What can you do to build on your strengths? How might you address your weaknesses? Maybe you could take a course to improve your skills or perhaps practice mindfulness to manage your impatience. Remember, this isn't a race. It's about making progress one step at a time. And while you're mapping out your personal development journey, remember that your strengths are your guiding lights and your weaknesses, the stars yet to be discovered. Every strength you harness and every weakness you transform becomes a milestone in your journey towards becoming the best version of yourself. With your list in hand, the next step is setting personal development goals. Remember, this journey is about progress, not perfection. Celebrate your strengths and embrace your weaknesses as opportunities for growth. Let's continue to explore and grow, leveraging our strengths and transforming our weaknesses into our greatest opportunities for growth. Ask yourself, how can I build on my strengths? What strategies can I employ to work on my weaknesses? This inquiry is not just about self-improvement, but about aligning your life with who you truly are. Setting personal development goals based on our strengths and weaknesses is a powerful step towards this alignment. Let's visualize this process. Imagine you're an architect, and your life is the building you're designing. Your strengths are the sturdy pillars, holding the structure high. They are your foundation, your go-to resources in times of need. And your weaknesses? They are the areas that need reinforcement, the parts of the structure that need a little more attention to stand tall. Now, as an architect, what would you do? You wouldn't ignore the weak parts or try to mask them. Instead, you would work on strengthening them, turning them into robust components of your structure. And of course, you would leverage the strength of the pillars, making sure they bear the weight they're capable of handling. This is how we should approach setting personal development goals. Identify your strengths and strategize ways to further enhance them. Are you a great communicator? Perhaps you could try public speaking or starting a podcast. Are you a problem solver? Maybe you could take on more challenging projects at work or try puzzles in your spare time. Then, turn to your weaknesses. Remember, these are not failures but opportunities for growth. Are you struggling with time management? You could set a goal to learn and implement a new organizational system. Is public speaking a challenge? Consider joining a local speaking club or practicing in front of friends. And through it all, remember to be patient with yourself. Personal development is a journey, not a race. It's about gradual progress, not overnight perfection. So celebrate your strengths. 
They are what make you unique, what set you apart, and embrace your weaknesses. They are your challenges, yes, but also your greatest opportunities for growth. Remember, this journey is about progress, not perfection. Celebrate your strengths and embrace your weaknesses as opportunities for growth. Identifying our strengths and weaknesses is a profound exercise in self-awareness. This is the journey we embarked on today, a journey that took us to the heart of our inner landscape. We learned that our strengths, those qualities that make us shine, serve as lighthouses, guiding us toward our best paths. Conversely, our weaknesses, often seen as obstacles, can become gateways to our most extraordinary growth. We dove into the process of self-discovery, understanding that it's not just about self-improvement, but about aligning our lives with our true selves. We discovered that reflection, honesty, and feedback from those around us are invaluable tools in this process. We heard from experts in the field of psychology who reminded us that self-awareness is the foundation of personal development. By understanding our strengths, we can leverage them. By acknowledging our weaknesses, we can address them. This insight led us to a simple yet powerful exercise designed to help us map our strengths and weaknesses. We reflected on moments of pride and achievements, identifying the qualities we exhibited as potential strengths. Then, we thought about times of challenge and criticism, viewing these highlighted areas as opportunities for growth, our weaknesses. Armed with this newfound self-awareness, we then set personal development goals. We asked ourselves, how can we build on our strengths? What strategies can we employ to work on our weaknesses? Remember, this journey is about progress, not perfection. Celebrate your strengths and embrace your weaknesses as opportunities for growth. Thank you for joining me in Module 5. Don't forget to subscribe for more insights into personal growth and self-awareness. Together, let's continue to explore and grow, leveraging our strengths and transforming our weaknesses into our greatest opportunities for growth.